expect a miracle. Hallelujah.
Thank you. Please put your hands together and let's appreciate our anointed Sister Ida. I can't hear your hand clap at all. Hallelujah. Tonight is the third night of healing Jesus Crusade. We've practically had a festival of miracles and salvation here. And tonight is a special night for someone. And I'm sure that someone is you tonight. I said that someone is you tonight. God has prepared a servant who is going to minister the word of God and the power of God. I said the word of God and the power of God. I believe as the word comes, we will never be the same again. Please rise to your feet and with joy, let's welcome Evangelist Daniel Mills tonight. Let us expect a miracle Everybody lift up your hands to the Lord. Heavenly Father, thank you for tonight. Thank you for your power. Thank you for your spirit that is guiding us today to do your will, to serve you, to please you. Oh God, thank you for the blood of Jesus that has been shed on the cross for us. We thank you for your blessing, for your healing power that is released in our midst today. Thank you that through the blood of Jesus we are set free we are healed and we are delivered tonight in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus thank you Lord for visiting us today in the name of Jesus Christ and everybody shouted amen God bless you. You may be seated. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you excited to be here tonight? Tonight is a night of special miracles. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want to first of all thank our wonderful pastors and bishops. And bishops. For your support for this crusade. May God bless you and may God increase your ministry. Amen. Amen. I also want to thank our Obas and Kings who have honored this crusade with their presence. One day, when you stand before the king of kings, may you also receive honor on that day. Amen. Amen. Because one day, all kings will meet the king of kings. And may God bless you for honoring his word and his servant. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tonight, I am preaching about the blood, the power of the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As Reinhard Bonke says, we are preaching about the ABC of the gospel. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. The blood of Jesus Christ is a wonderful thing. Many people do not know how powerful the blood of Jesus is. 
In Leviticus chapter 17, the Bible says, For the life of the flesh is in the blood. And I have given it to you upon the altar to make an atonement for your souls. Therefore I said unto you, no soul of you shall eat blood. For it is the life of all flesh. The blood of it is for the life thereof. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Many, many thousands of years ago, the prophet Moses taught us about the importance of the blood. He explained that there is life in blood. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That blood contains life. Amen. Amen. And that is why Jesus said in John chapter 6, he said, except you eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, you have no life in you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So the blood of Jesus gives us life. Amen. Amen. Now you may ask, how does blood give life? Blood gives life. Because blood has been created to give life. Any part of the body where there is no blood, that part of the body dies. Amen. Amen. Many years ago, I was at a hospital in Ghana called Kolebu Teaching Hospital. It is the biggest hospital in Ghana. And I was with a professor in the clinic. And suddenly, the professor called me to come and look at something. When I entered the examination room, there was a man lying on the couch. And the man had two legs. But the two legs had two different colors. One of the legs was dark brown, and the other leg was black, black. And so as I look at the legs of the man, the professor told me that I should touch the legs. When I touched the leg, one of the legs was warm, and one of the legs was cold. One of the legs was warm. And one was cold. And then the professor told me, this man's leg is dead. How can somebody have a leg that is dead? Because what happened was that the man had an accident. And the, inside the leg, the blood vessel was cut, but you couldn't see it outside. And it was a big blood vessel. So all the leg, all the blood going there was not going. And, and because 
blood was not going to the leg. The man even didn't know that blood was not going to his leg. So the leg died. The whole leg was dead. It was cold like a dead body and it had become very black. It had died. Why did it die? Because the blood did not go there. Are you listening to me? Because blood gives life. Wherever blood goes, life goes there. Are you listening to me? Wherever the blood of Jesus Christ goes, life goes to that place. And where the blood of Jesus does not go, that place dies. So when people do not hear about Jesus Christ, and they do not hear about the blood of Jesus. Maybe a whole section of Nigeria. A whole section of Ghana. Or Togo. They don't hear about the blood of Jesus. And the blood of Jesus does not go there. That whole place dies. And people die and go to hell. That is why it is very important. Even though Moses was not a doctor. He prophesied many years ago. And he said the life is in the blood. The life is in the blood. For people to have life. Blood must flow to that place. And tonight. I am telling you. That there is a blood. It is not the blood of a goat. It is not the blood of a, a sheep. It is the blood of the Lamb of God. And tonight, that blood is flowing in each row. And it is bringing life here. I said it is bringing life here. You will be saved because of the blood of Jesus. Because there is life in the blood. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The blood of Jesus is giving us life. Anytime somebody does not receive the blood, that place dies. Tonight, if you do not receive my message about the blood of Jesus, you will die and you will go to hell and you will have nothing that can save you from your sins. When you see a man who has a stroke, stroke, paralyzed, this hand cannot move. This leg cannot move. Do you know why? Do you know why? Do you want to know why? I cannot hear you. Do you want to know why? The arm is dead. And the leg is dead. And sometimes he cannot speak well. It is because the blood did not flow in a certain part of the brain. So that part of the brain is dead. The commander of the right hand and the commander of the right leg died. When the blood stopped flowing there. So anytime the blood of Jesus does not flow, there is no lie. And death comes. You see, in the in the blood, we have oxygen. Oxygen gives life. In the blood, we have immunoglobulin. And it fights sicknesses that will kill you. In the blood, we have blood cells that take away carbon dioxide that would have killed you in the blood we carry away chemicals 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 
cleared away by the blood. And that is why any time the blood does not go somewhere, even in the hospital, people die. Ladies and gentlemen, I have good news for you. The power of the blood of Jesus can save you from your sin. That is why we make a lot of noise about the blood of Jesus. Maybe what we sing, there is power. Power in the blood of Jesus. But you, yes. I, people don't know why. But it's a powerful thing. It is a powerful thing. But the blood is flowing. It's flowing to save you and to heal you from your sicknesses, from your sin. It has come to Egypt to carry away your sins, your mistakes, your crimes. I see the blood flowing. I see the blood of Jesus. It's flowing to carry it away. To carry away the curse. The curse of darkness. The curse of the devil. The blood is flowing to take away your sin. Hallelujah. There is power. Power. Power in the blood. is the most important thing that we need. God sent his son to this earth 2,000 years ago and he came to this world and he preached and preached and preached, and preached. Jesus was a far better preacher than me. He was a better preacher than Reinhard Bonke. Bonke. But after three years of preaching, Jesus stopped preaching. Why did Jesus stop preaching? Why? Why didn't Jesus travel from Jerusalem to Morocco, Algeria, through Egypt, down to Nigeria. Why didn't he come? He could have come. Ah, ah. Why didn't he come and preach here? There were people here. Do you want to know why Jesus didn't come here? Because if he was going to go around the whole world, he would never have finished going around. But more important, because the preaching could not save you. There is something that would save you. 
that will save you. And that was his blood. Oni ejere. His blood. Ejere. Yeah, not his preaching. Beni kise wasu His blood. Ejere ni. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because without the shedding of blood, there is no remission of sin. Without shedding of blood, unless blood is shed, you will never be forgiven. No matter what you do, you can be a very good person. You don't do this. 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 Oh, to me now. But I tell you, the Bible says there is none righteous. Nobody is righteous. Even if you try and try and try, you realize that you are not righteous. Amen. Amen. So, my friend, there is nothing that you can do to save yourself. Amen. Amen. Preaching cannot save you. But there is something that can save you from your sin. And that is the blood of Jesus. The lamb of God that was slain for you and for me. That is why in the book of Revelation, Jesus is the lamb that was slain. He is the lamb that was slain. He is the lamb of God that taketh away the sins of the world. What can wash away my sin? What can wash away your sin? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Are you excited about the blood of Jesus? So Jesus Christ he stopped preaching and he went to Jerusalem. Jerusalem. In Jerusalem, in Jerusalem, there were pastors and Pharisees who were ready to kill Jesus. And Jesus knew. Jesus knew. You see, before I went to Israel, I used to think that Galilee, Jerusalem, they are all in the same place. But one day when I went to Israel, I was in Jerusalem, and I took a taxi, and I told the driver, please, I'm going to Galilee. Take me to Galilee. And the driver started laughing. I was in Jerusalem. And I took a taxi. I said, take me to Galilee. And he asked me, do you know where is Galilee? Galilee is about 200 kilometers far away. It's far away. That is where Jesus was. All his miracles. In Capernaum. In Bethsaida. All were far away. And that is where he was preaching. By the Sea of Galilee. Today, if you go to Galilee, they have a, a restaurant where they sell fish. The fish is called St. Peter's Fish. Peteru. Peteru is what? Peter. Peteru. Yes, Peter. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Peter's Fish. Jesus was not staying in uh, Jerusalem at all. No way. He was far away. He was preaching far away. But when he wanted to shed his blood, he decided to go to where they kill pastors. All Jerusalem. 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 The prophet. All prophets have been killed in Jerusalem. And, and he knew that if they was to sacrifice, they to be in Jerusalem. They will not kill Jesus in Galilee. But in Jerusalem. So he started marching. 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 
to Jerusalem. Lo si Jerusalem. Two hundred kilometers. Ni wo ibu ifsoa iba. And as he was going, the Bible say he made his face. He determined to go there. And as you are getting to Jerusalem, you have to pass through Jericho. That is where, as he was entering the town, he saw blind Bartimaeus. And he healed him. And then when he entered Jericho, he saw a sycamore tree. And he saw Zacchaeus on the tree. And he said, come down. Today, I'm coming to your house. I'm coming to bless your house. Tonight, Jesus is passing to you to come and bless your house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And as he passed through Jericho, he started to ascend. Jericho is down. The Jericho one is Jerusalem is up. Jerusalem is so be going up. Oh, so he so has ascended okay. to Mount Zion. Okay. Mount Zion is inside Jerusalem. Okay. And he started going up oh, so to okay. Jerusalem. See Jerusalem. Oh, Jerusalem. He was Jerusalem. That kills the prophets. He knew that he was going to die oh, there. He told Peter. Oh, so he said they will kill me. Oh, they will sacrifice me. Oh, Why did Jesus want to go and die? Because without the shedding of blood, you in Nigeria, and me in Ghana, 2,000 years later, we cannot be saved. That is why. That's why he stopped. He was only 33 years old. He could have preached to 78. He could have been preaching to 88 years old. But he, he came to this world to save the world. God so loved the world. God so loved the world that he gave his only son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Hallelujah. 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 That is why Jesus came to shed his blood on the cross. So they put him on the cross and he lay on the cross and they nailed his hand. Don't worry. And the blood started to come out of his hand. Wow. 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 They nailed his other hand. The blood came out of five different places. It came out of his hands. It came out of his feet. That blood. What can wash? What can wash your sin? Nothing but the blood. They nailed it. And it started to come out. From the hands. As it was dropping. Your salvation. My salvation. Your salvation. Started to come. And appear in this world. Salvation. From our sins. They beat him on his back. Whipped him. Blood was coming out. Of his back. That is the blood. It was flowing. From the back. When they put it on the on the cross, and the, and the blood was scratching. Was scratching where they have they have beaten him. And the blood was smearing on the cross. They put a crown of thorns on his head. And they pressed it. And the blood started to come. That was the fourth place. The blood was flowing. It was flowing from the cross of Jesus. And then finally, they took a spear. And they, they pierced his stomach. Hey, hey. 
And the blood came out of the stomach. The blood of Jesus Christ. The blood by which you are saved. That's why Jesus said, If you don't eat my body and drink my blood, you cannot have eternal life. You have to partake of that blood that flowed out of Calvary. And tonight, that blood is flowing over here. You see, without the blood, I don't know what you will do. Where are you going to pass? How many people have told a lie before? How many liars are here? Where will you pass a liar? How can a liar go to heaven? When you go to heaven, you start doing 419 so in heaven. Heaven, heaven will get spoiled. Oh. oh! How many have stolen something before? Wave, wave, you have stolen you it before. You it how can they allow, doctor, how can we allow a thief to go to heaven? Now we are going to have armed robbers in heaven. Armed robbers will be stealing the gold from the streets. No, 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 no. The Bible says outside are thieves and liars. Murderers. How many have killed somebody before? Abortion. Hatred. We are all here. How can we enter heaven? What can wash away your sins and my sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 The Bible says, if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us. If we walk in the light as he is in the light, we have fellowship one with another. And the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, cleanses us from all sin. Tonight, the blood of Jesus is cleaning you. I said it's cleaning you. I said it's washing you. Hey. Hey. Nothing can wash away your sins. Nothing but the blood of Jesus Christ. Tonight, that blood is available for you and for me. There is nothing, no sacrifice, no attempt, no religion that can save you except the blood of Jesus Christ. Because the Bible says it is his blood that cleanses us from all our sins. And tonight, that blood is here to wash away your sins. You see, your sin cannot easily be washed. Yes. Your sin cannot easily be washed. Your sins are deeper than any debt. One day, a certain man, he went to the farm and in Ghana, Ni Ghana, and he was attacked by someone on the farm. When he, at, he was attacked, he took a cutlass and he cut the man and the man stomach open and the man died. And the man's blood came on him. So, he went and hit the man and he ran to the house and when he got home, he took off his shirt, which had the blood, and he went to wash it. White. Nobody could see. And he hung the shirt. And he washed himself. And all the blood was gone. And nobody knew that he had done anything. So one day, he was sleeping in the night. And he got up. He was asleep. 
But he woke up once he was sleeping and started to walk. And as he was walking, he was talking. And he started to talk about the man he has killed. Hey, hey. And his wife was listening to him. And his wife said, Hey, hey. What is this man saying? What has he done? Every night, the man woke up, walking about, and he was talking, out, 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 blood, go out. Do you know what was happening to this man? The man was going mad because even though he has washed the blood out of his shed. He could not wash the sin out of his heart. Because soap cannot wash away your sins. Omo cannot wash away your sin. Key soap cannot wash away your sin. What can wash away our sins? Only the blood of Jesus Christ can wash away your sins. And that is why he didn't hear when you see a church so can, which has put the cross outside so man, we are able to sit down. when you see the work of God so man, you are and they put the blood outside so if you are sit they down. do not understand Whoa, money. that it is the blood we are that now. is the only thing only on that so can save you and me so what, me. what can save you today so nothing but the blood of Jesus see, are Jesus look Christian. young man standing over there Christ, do you me? listen to me me dada. you may not hear it again Jesus did not die for nothing. He sent me here to speak to you. God is warning you today. He says, come to the cross. And kneel down. Bow down to God. Humble yourself. And receive the blood of Jesus. Turn away from your sins. Turn away now. Repent. Repent. Of 419. Of wickedness. Of hypocrisy, of witchcraft, of occultism, of half Christianity, half juju. A bit of God, a bit of the devil. Turn around. God is not mocked. Come and enter the narrow way. God is calling you to come into his gate. Enter the gate. The narrow gate. The small gate. And he will wash you. One day, you will hear that I am dead. When you hear, don't be sad. Because I will be with the Lord. But when I get to heaven, and when I stand at the gate, and I see Peter standing there, and Peter asks me, how, why do I want to come? I'm not going to say, I am a pastor. So allow me to enter. No. Being a pastor does not allow you to enter. Not because I've preached to a lot of people. Not because I've prayed for the same. The reason why I can enter heaven is the same reason why you can enter heaven. It's because of the blood of Jesus Christ that I wash away my sins. That is the reason why I, I have a right to enter. Not because of anything that I have done or anything that I have not done, but because of the blood of Jesus. Do you want that blood of Jesus in your life? That is the only reason why you can go to heaven today. Because of the blood of Jesus that was shed for you on the cross of Calvary. That's why as Christians, we, we wear a cross. A cross is precious. It's a precious thing to wear. It's a symbol of the sacrifice of the blood that was shed for all the sins. The night before Jesus died, he lifted up the cup and he said, this cup 
is a new my blood in the New Testament which is given for the remission of the sins of men. Tonight, Jesus is calling you to come to the cross. How many want to come to the cross and receive the blood of Jesus? If you want Jesus Christ to come into your life and wash away your sins, how many want to wash away your sins? What can wash away your sins? What can wash away your sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus Christ. If you want the blood of Jesus to wash away your sins, I want you to stand to your feet. I'm going to pray a special prayer with you. What can wash away your sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus and what can make me whole again. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Oh, oh precious. What can make me whole again? Nothing but the blood. See, I jelly. Jesus Christ to wash away your sins tonight. Lift up two hands. And I'm going to pray a special prayer with all of us. Nothing can wash away your sins. Only this precious blood. And say this prayer after me. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Tonight is my night. Tonight is my night. Oh God. Oh God. I know I am a sinner. I know I am a sinner. I have sinned and sinned and sinned. I have sinned and sinned and sinned. Oh God. Tonight I come to the cross. 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 Just as I am. Just as I am. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please wash away my sins. Please wash away my sins. With your precious blood. With your precious blood. Wash me, Lord. Wash me, Lord. Everybody say, wash me, Lord. Wash me, Lord. Wash me, Lord. With your blood. With your blood. With your precious blood. With your precious blood. Cleanse me, Lord. Cleanse me, Lord. Cleanse me. Cleanse me. From all my sins. From 
from all my sin. I am a sinner. I am a sinner. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I am a sinner. I am a sinner. But tonight, but tonight, I come to the cross. I come to the cross. Wash me, Lord. Wash me, Lord. With this precious blood. With this precious blood. Tonight, tonight, I receive. I receive the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Tonight, tonight, I receive. I receive Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ as my Savior. As my Savior. My Master. My Master. And my Lord. And my Lord. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus Christ. For dying on the cross for me. For dying on the cross for me. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus Christ. For dying on the cross for, for me. For dying on the cross for me. From tonight. From tonight. Everybody say from tonight. Come on, yes. Away from tonight. From tonight. From tonight. I belong to Jesus. I belong to Jesus. I belong to Jesus. I belong to Jesus. I will follow Jesus. I will follow Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For saving my soul. For saving my soul. With your life. With your life. And your blood. And your blood. Now say after me. Satan. Now. Say, Everybody say Satan. 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 Listen to me. Listen to me. From today. From today. I will not follow you again. I will not follow you again. Lift your hands. Say Satan. Lift your hands. Say Satan. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I am free from you. I am free from you. I am free from you. I am free from you through the blood of Jesus. Through the blood of Jesus. I am saved. I am saved. I am born again. I am born again. By the blood of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. Lift your two hands and say, Thank you, Jesus. For saving me tonight. I love you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. For dying for me. Hallelujah. 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 Sibi <laughs> Fifa gbo gbo ese mi sonu lati oni lo fi ejere ti e ta sile lori igi agbelebu fo gbo gbo ise dede mi sonu fifa gbo gbo won sonu pata ko oruko mi sinu iwe iye lati oni lo mo jewo re ni oluwa mo gba o gege bi oluwa mi mo gba o gege bi baba mi mo gba o gege bi elede mi mama tele olati oni lo mi o se ti satani mo mo fi gbogbo aye mi fun o titi lai ni o ma yin o titi lai ni o ma se ife re lati oni lo oluwa o se o tori gbe ati gba mi la loni Tori gbe ati so mi di atun bi Tori gbe aye mi ti di otun loni Tori gbe mo ti di eni igbala Ese o Jesu Ogo ni fun oruko yin Ami wa so bayi pe Satani Satani pada leyin mi mi o se ti e mo mo ti di atun bi mo ti di omo lerun ati gba mi la ke haleluya haleluya oh give the lord a mighty shout oh yeah i be one life with jesus are you happy that the blood of jesus jesus be wash away your sins go ti wa gbogbo ese re so no haleluya haleluya oh yeah i want to shout oh yeah you are going to keep it you are going to keep it haleluya haleluya Now all of you who prayed, 
I want to give you one of my books. Tonight, are you expecting miracles? The Bible says, when I see the blood, I will pass over. From tonight, all demonic forces will pass over you. They can never come near you. Because of the blood of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The blood of Jesus is the most precious thing to us. But tonight, Jesus wants to heal us. Jesus Christ, over our son. He wants to save us. I just also want to make an announcement tomorrow morning. Last pastors and church workers conference. Six o'clock in the morning. Nine thirty ten we have closed. Later. When the sun comes, we close. So be here early. It's the last day of the conference. But not the last day of the crusade. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now I want to read a scripture. In Acts chapter 10, verse 38. Bible says how God anointed Jesus. Who went about doing good and healing. All. That were oppressed of the devil. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You see, the reason why we sing the song, Jesus is a healing Jesus. Everybody say, a healing Jesus. Say, a healing Jesus. It is because Jesus is not only a Jesus who preaches. It's not a, just a preaching Jesus. Or a teaching Jesus. That is Jesus who teaches. Or a wise Jesus. Jesus who is wise. But he's also a healing Jesus. Jesus who heals. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Are you excited about that? That Jesus Christ is a healing Jesus. And tonight, whatever problem you came here with, you are not going to go back home with that same problem. Because Jesus' power is here tonight to set you free and to heal you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you listening? So Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, the Bible says, everywhere he went, he was doing good. But what was the reason why he was able to do good? Why was he able to do good and to heal people? When he went here, he healed. I was son. When he went here, he healed. Your was son. When he went here, he healed. Your was son. The question is, how? Why? Kennedy. The Bible tells us why. Do you want to know why? I didn't hear. Do you want to know why? Why Jesus was able to heal? He was able to heal because. The Bible says he was anointed. It is the anointing that heals. No, nobody can heal. It is the Holy Spirit. The anointing of the Holy Spirit that heals. So that anointing of Jesus is here today also. Do you know why? Because Jesus is the same yesterday. He's the same today. And he's the same forever. That's why the Bible tells us God anointed Jesus. Everybody say God anointed Jesus. God anointed Jesus. Amen. Amen. And Jesus was anointed Anointed. So because he was anointed, anywhere he went, 
miracles were happening. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So when the anointing is there, miracles will happen. And tonight, I declare miracles will happen in your life. Because the anointing is here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do you believe in miracles? Do you believe in miracles? Do you believe in the anointing? Jesus is a healing Jesus. Amen. Amen. One day, Jesus went somewhere to Capernaum. It's a town by the Sea of Galilee. And a lot of people, a lot of people gathered in so much that there was no room to receive them. And then there came one who was sick of the palsy, he was paralyzed. They were carrying him. Tonight, if you were carried here, you will walk home in the name of Jesus. And four people were carrying him. And the Bible says when they couldn't come near, they climbed the roof and removed the roofing sheet and removed the ceiling. And and they, they dropped the man through the ceiling and they put the man in front of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Today you are standing in front of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And when Jesus saw their faith, he said to the sick man, My son, thy sins are forgiven thee. Tonight, maybe you have sinned. That is why some sickness has come to you. But I have good news for you. Through the blood of Jesus, all your sins are being washed away and forgiven tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And the Bible says, some people were standing by and they said in their head, why does this man speak blasphemy? He is blaspheming. How can you say somebody's sins are forgiven? Only God can forgive sin. And immediately, Jesus knew what they were thinking. So he said to them, Is it easier to say to the sick man, rise, or is it easier to say, be forgiven? But so that you will know the Son of Man has power to forgive, he said to the sick man, I say unto thee, arise, take up thy bed, and go thy way into thine house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And immediately, he arose and took up the bed and went forth before them all. Insomuch so much that they were all amazed and glorified God, saying, we never saw it on this fashion. Give a clap offering to Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a wonderful Jesus. We are serving today. Jesus said to the sick man, Arise, arise take up your bed, and walk. Mani. Today, Loni. anything that has kept you down, you are going to rise out of that thing Wadi today in the name of Loni. Jesus. One day, Ni we went to a certain town, and uh, uh, there was a man who was paralyzed, and uh, he was sitting in the, he was lying at the back there, during the miracle time, God's power touched him, and he came to the front, 
somehow he was able to stand on the stage and he was so amazed later on at another crusade doctor do you remember this man he came he with about 36 people in a, in a bus his name was Bismarck because he was healed. And he came with about 36 people oh, in the oh, 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 oh. for many, many, many months. Oh, 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 oh. And he came oh, oh, oh. to testify. Oh, oh, oh. He, he, he sold his televisions and everything to pay uh, uh, juju men, fetish priests, all kinds of things to be healed. But Jesus healed him during that crusade. I did not even know him because a lot of people came to pass on the stage. I didn't even remember him. But when he came back to another crusade with a bus full of people, to come and testify again about how he had been healed. I myself marveled. No, you see, I don't know how to heal people. The doctor here also doesn't know what to do. But Jesus is the one who heals people. Are you listening to me? Jesus is the one who told this man, Rise up. Rise up. Take up your bed and walk. Mani. People were amazed. And tonight, I will be amazed at what Jesus is going to do in your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. One day, I went to uh, Colombia. And there was a, a lady there. She came to the crusade. And uh, she, her child was a, a child was dead. Hey. Not sick, dead. She went to the clinic in the afternoon. And they told her your child is dead. You have to leave the body. But she said no. I've heard of a crusade. I will take my dead child to the crusade. So she brought the child. During the prayer time, the miracle time, the power of God came on the child who was dead, and the child just came back to life. So she came to the stage. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. She came on stage holding a baby and crying. I have her picture on one of my tracks. And she was crying. So I asked my interpreter, what is wrong with this woman? And when he asked her, I could not believe what she was saying. That Jesus attached her child and the child who was dead was was raised up. The next day, at the crusade, they brought more dead people for me to raise. Hey. Hey. I said, me, I don't know how to raise a dead person. When I came to the crusade, the soldiers took me, they took me to the side of the stage. Here was a dead man covered with bed sheets. I've never seen so many ambulances all over. And people have come because they, they had heard about what the Lord had done. Yet the day before. But you see, I didn't go down to pray for the man. I, I, I didn't raise him uh, the first one from the dead. It's Jesus who raised you from Jesus the dead. Amen. Amen. I'm just a man. But the anointing of the Lord is upon me. And when the anointing is there, anything can happen. I said anything can happen. I said anything can happen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And tonight, that anointing if you is here. Oh, and Jesus yes, is ready to touch you oh, and heal you of awesome. every curse in your oh, life. Boy, Are you yeah, listening to me? Yeah, do you believe in miracles? Yes, by, uh, Do you believe that Jesus can heal you yes, today? Yes, Do you believe that it is your turn today? Yes, How many believe me? that tonight is I'm your night? Jesus is a healing Jesus. Yes, he 
is the Lord that healed thee tonight. I want to pray for you. I want you to stand up. We are going to pray. His name is Jehovah. Jehovah. Rofi. Rofi. The Lord that healed thee. Right now, wherever you are sick in your body, I want you to put your hand there. If it is your eyes, put your hand on your eyes. If it is your stomach, put your hand on your stomach. If it is your breast, put your hand on your breast. If it is your heart, put your hand on your heart. Wherever the sickness is, tonight, Jesus, Jesus Christ is here to heal you. Somebody is here, you cannot walk, but God is telling you today, rise up, take up your bed, and walk in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. 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 I bind the curse of the enemy. I bind the curse of the devil. I bind every wicked power of darkness. Fighting the people. In the name of Jesus. Let the power of the devil be broken in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let the power of darkness be broken in the name of Jesus. Let the curse of darkness be broken in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for your power that is flowing in this place. Somebody's being healed in the eyes. Somebody's being healed in the neck. Somebody's being healed of madness. Madness. Mental sickness. Depression. Schizophrenia. In the name of Jesus. Be healed. Be healed. Be healed. Be healed. Every chest condition. I don't know any. Every chest cup condition. Tuberculosis. Asthma. Chest pain. I bind it in the name of Jesus. I break it in the name of Jesus. Every sickness. That will shorten your life. Every curse. That will shorten your life. Every sickness. That is inside your body today. That will shorten your life. I bind it in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. I said receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive the anointing of the Lord. The Spirit of the Lord is here. His anointing is here. He's here to heal you today. Lift your hand, everybody. Thank God, thank God right now. For miracles. For healing. For his power. Thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Put your hand on your stomach. Father, thank you for healing. Baba, in the stomach. Women sicknesses. Bobo, sicknesses of women. Bobo, I rebuke it in Jesus' name. Barrenness. Bobo, yagan. Bleeding. 
Eyebright. Oh boy, 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 I break it in the name of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Be healed. Oh, yeah, by what's up? Cancer. Of every cast of the devil. In the name of Jesus. Every stomach pain. Stomach ulcer. Oh boy, oh Every curse of the devil. Oh boy, go Satan. Be healed of it in and the name of Jesus. Be healed of it in the name and of Jesus. Be healed of it in the name of Jesus. Be healed of it in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. The spirit of the Lord is here. Emi Olaru Wambi. The spirit of the Lord is here. Emi Olaru Wambi. The spirit of the Lord is here. Emi Olaru Wambi. Father, thank you for wonderful miracles. We, we worship you, Lord. You have already done wonderful things. We thank you, Lord. Everybody thank God right now. For he has touched you tonight. He has healed you by faith. You are healed tonight. His power is here. God's power has healed you tonight. Thank him right now. His power has healed you tonight. Thank you, Lord, for this great blessing. Thank you for this great power. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Right now, I want you to check yourself. Maybe you had a pain, but the pain is gone. Maybe you couldn't walk. Rise up and walk right now. Tonight is a night for walking. Tonight is a night for walking. Rise up and walk. Be healed in the name of Jesus. The power of God is here. Maybe you were bleeding. But the bleeding has stopped. Maybe there was a pain. But the pain has stopped. Maybe, stopped. Maybe, stopped. Maybe you couldn't see. But right now, open your eyes. Jesus has healed you. Thank you, Lord. For your power. Thank you, Jesus. The curse is broken. In the name of Jesus. Right now, I want you to check yourself. If Jesus has touched you, if Jesus has healed you, Wherever you are standing, maybe you couldn't see, you couldn't walk, maybe you couldn't do something, maybe you, do something. maybe you felt the power of God. Oh, some people are already coming. I want you to come to the side here. Come from wherever you are. Maybe, maybe you are far away. But God has touched you. Come quickly from wherever you are. Wow! My ball. Maybe Boy, yeah. you were healed yesterday, but it wasn't yet, no? but you were not able to come. Tomorrow, come quickly now. My ball. Yeah, yeah, Maybe you were healed the day before. But it wasn't yet, uh. When you went home, Ni you realized that you are healed. Oh, what if that was, uh. Come quickly. My ball. Yeah, yeah. Miracles are happening now. Yeah, no. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Come right now. My ball. Bye bye. Jesus is power. Yes, you are being Jesus power. I bet that Jesus is strong.
has healed you. I want you to come quickly. It is very, very important that you come. Because I'm going to pray with you again. Everybody come. If God has touched you. If God has touched you. If God has touched you. All of us have received miracles. But if you can see it. And see that something has happened. God has healed you. God has healed you. God has healed you. God has healed you. What's happening here? Fantastic miracles tonight. This man fell two years ago and could not walk without the sick. He had a problem with his leg. Tonight, as we are praying, the power of God entered him. Wow! wow. 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 He realized that strength has come into the leg. I fell from a fence for the past two years. I can't walk with my legs, and I've undergo series of operations. But tonight, I claim my healing. And you can walk? I can walk now. You can walk now? Yes. Look at this, a grown-up, he's crying, a grown-up man. Come this way, come this way, come this way. Come this way. You can walk without this. You can walk without this. You can walk without this. Wow. Yes. Hey. 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 My God is good. You are what? Brother, brother to him. You are, are, you, are the you surprised? Jay, I know For past two years, it's going to work. But now, I thank God now, it's going to work. Thank you, Father. Oh, wow. God. Lunch, he was just jumping down there. The, the friend, friend was jumping the friend down there. Jumping more than, more than the one who In the him. Bible, the friends of the man brought the man. Uh -huh. The friends of the man brought the man. Uh -huh. The man, the man, the the man, man was healed. God has said, this is the one of the four friends. 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 Scripture this practically seen here. In Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name. And bless his friend too, Lord. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Hey, another fantastic miracle hey, tonight. Hey, hey, hey. Mama has been bleeding, bleeding for hey, hey, some time hey, hey. now. Bleeding. Hey, hey, hey. As we hey, hey, hey. pray tonight. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. But now it is stopped by the grace of God. Hey, hey, hey. 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 No, no, no more bleeding now. It's so getting no duro. Yes, yes. You see, yes. for those of you who don't believe the Bible, I want Jesus you to was in the crowd just like this. Yes, so I look better. Be a lady. A woman bleeding. Just, just like, like this. Just like this. Be a lady. She had been bleeding for how, how long? For a dumelo. Past more than a year now. Look at this lady, doctor. What could this be? This could be due to endometriosis. It could be due to cancer of the uterus. I don't go use but then said they are going to do operation for me. But I say no. I don't need the operation again because say about 24 years now I don't do my last one is by operation. He said, no. And you yeah, believe no, Jesus has healed you? Oh no, till I see you, What did you feel tonight? Paulo Sherry. As, as it is, was bleeding before. It's now stopped. As I press. One I, kill I, only me a shale. He only me a shale. It's like a donation. Give Jesus a shale. Hallelujah. Kilo mutomiwa. Oh, re, re, lo mutomiwa. This is woman is postmenopausal. That makes it bleeding. Very serious. So it's a serious thing. Until far is so dead. Anyone saw you? Postmenopausal. A woman bleeding. this age should not be bleeding. No, no, no. So, I believe tonight God has even healed the cancer. I think oh, I have a gynecologist. Gynecologist here. Gynecologist. Doctor Nabi, I see here. 
Is that any gynecologist? Please come, Lord. Is there any Tony? Tony? Any Tony? Money? Why he was sent here? I want Billy. Why am B? Oh, Tony. That's a gynecologist. Any Tony? Money? Why he was sent here? I want Billy. This lady is bleeding. She was bleeding, but the bleeding has stopped. What could this be? Oh, she's broken her leg. What? Fibroids. Fibroids. Oh, lady, I want you to do endometriosis. I want to live for anyone's son. Functional uterine bleeding. Wow. And what again? What are that more dangerous? It could be cancer of the uterus. Cancer. Or cancer, or cancer of the cervix. Cancer of the cervix. Yes. These are very deadly deadly cervical. I told you, cancer, cancerous conditions. How do you say endometriosis? <laughs> 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 At her age, it's most likely that she had a cancer of some sort. At her age? Yes. Yeah. Everybody stretch out your hand. This lady oh, being healed of cancer or whatever sickness the enemy is planting on her. She says she felt it. Unless you don't believe in the Bible, but the I woman in the Bible, Bible, she was also in church. And I believe the one who will know and will judge it. All the way, they're not running. Father, thank you for your mercy and your healing power. Give the Lord a mighty clap of Amen. God bless you. Amen. Quickly. Five years ago, Mama had an accident, and this is how she was being walked. This is how she used to walk. Five, five years. years. Five years. And now, tell me now. Now, 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 Hallelujah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, ni lost on. Ebo mi boru kore, hey, e mi ni tinje mi ni. Oloru kahula, e mi ni masheberu. Oloru kahula, ula 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 ula. Oyi gi 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 kabi osi. Oba to 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 kabi aye. E mi ni, e mi ni, e mi ni masheberu. Ebo mi boru kore, she could not do what. Walk. Five walk. years ago, she had an accident, and because of that, she, she was like this. She was bent over. She was bent. Doctor, and her what? waist. Doctor, uh, doctor, okay. This, Father, thank you for miracle. She was bent over. Bent oh, over. Bent like she she was see. In Jesus oh, name. Dada. Oh, Give the Jesus. Lord a mighty clap offering. This man for 20 years, for God, say, ye. he says that when he's traveling, yeah. every kilometer, to he has to stop, he tell the driver, driver, stop, oh, I want to wee wee. Then you urinate. I the next, I want to wee wee. He will do that ni. till the end. He, he says he in the night 15 times or 20 times. Now, now his double. leg was also swollen. Yesterday, he came out. When you were praying for oh, those who wanted, wanted to be prayed for, she, she came. came. He said immediately you touched oh, them. That was it. Come. Since yesterday night to today, you only once. Only once. Oh, 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 I need a doctor here. You talk. Let him talk. Let him talk. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God is real. I parked my car in the auto. That was on Monday. I, I, I came here with the transport. On, on Tuesday, I woke up. My leg became a mortar. My house is just opened to Hati. My neighbors are here in the church. Are here in the crusade. My leg became a mortar. I said, God, my, my, my leg is becoming a mortar. Mortar is what? Odo. As big as bottom, I couldn't raise Mota. it. Odo. Yes, my neighbors Mota. are here. My house is opposite to her to here. I carried my leg here. When I came to church the first day, devil is a bad. It's a, it devil is wicked. There was no money for me to give offering. I lose my wristwatch. I drop it in the offering basket. I, I said, God, this is a seed. The problem became worse. When I, the God, the Spirit of God told me that the following day I'm going to perfect it. When I came here, he said, you will touch the man of God. I said, how will I touch the man of God? It is either you touch the man of God or he touches you. After the crusade, I came here, these people stopped me. This man is there. 
He heard me. I said, I have to go. I, I came under this place. He's there. I came under. I creeped under this place. He's there. Yesterday, I crept. When I got there, my head me again. I pushed him. I said, I have to be healed. Let me go. This man is there. They want me to touch my heart. I got home. I slept like it. I woke up around 12 o'clock. I discovered, I wanted to, I, I said, ah, is it not time for the urinate? He said, no more urination. I look at my leg. My leg has disappeared. I said, wow. He thought 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 he Sister. Who are you? I'm a sister, sir. Your sister. Yes. What he's saying is it true? It's true. He urinates every night. Even his leg was swollen um, um, the, three days ago while we came for the crusade. I came for the crusade too. And he wheezes all the time. Yes. I came for the crusade too, so I saw his leg. I said, "What happened to your leg?" He said, "He doesn't know that it's just swollen." And Doctor, swollen leg, what could it be? A sudden swelling of the leg can be due to a deep venous thrombosis. Hey, sometimes also you can have cellulitis. Sometimes you can also have what you call lymphedema. Suddenly, this can also be, be as a result of actually obstruction of the Arterial system. Sometimes kidney, kidney failure can do this. I want also. And and if it is both legs, a heart problem can you know, cause the feet yeah, to yeah, swell. But the power of God has touched it. Then yeah, you said, you by all means, you must touch the man of God. I said, when I, when I, when I came here, the man hurt me. This man hurt me. I said, who, who held you? This man, this man. Call, call him. This man hurt me. I said, you can't hold me. You can't hold me. Who was holding I have to touch him. This man. This they hurt me, yes. I came under here. When I got out of my head yesterday, I said I would touch him. When I'm driving, when I'm driving, I will drive my car. Back. From before I get to Aramako, I will park, I will urinate. Really? In my compound, I will urinate more than 50 times. Nobody knew this for over 20 years. Since yesterday, it's only once I've urinated. <laughs> only once. <laughs> only once. <laughs> <Jesus. laughs> <laughs> Fantastic miracle. I mean, what, what has happened here? You need to have about two to three months of medication for this. In fact, some of them can get healed. The women sometimes can even be due to either. Diabetes. 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 Infections can cause this type of. I mean, God has done a multiple healing. For you. Thank you for your great, powerful healing. A multiple healing in tonight. Name, in Fantastic miracle. When this man goes to toilets, blood comes every time. It is a constant part of the activity. But since he came to this crusade, he said for the first time yesterday, when he went to the toilet. There was no blood at all in the suit. He has done it again today, and there's no blood at all. The Lord has done this fantastic thing. Let him speak. Yoruba, let him speak. More than 15 years. What the Lord I go anywhere, huh? Then tell me, say, now somebody, he do me like this. Somebody, he do me like this. Sometimes I go to hospital, go operate myself because of that blood. Now, woman, I'm supposed to be the blood. 
But the white right woman. Man, they bleed the blood when the woman uh, wait for bleed. bleed I the blood. anywhere. I take anything. When I, when I uh, tell me I do. Uh, see, yes. That is no come out. That is no come out. The no blood out. no come out from there. When I come here, David was a day. When I hear your voice, I come here. I sit, I sit yesterday morning. I can never see blood again. Wow. Hallelujah. Only land now. Oh, but only town. Man, I demand you town. He said, when he goes to the toilet, it's like menstruation. That only but don't buy lost seed. But don't see lost all. Be but don't be buying lost seed. Lost seed. Lost seed. Lost when he goes to toilet, that, that's the word he used. The ladies, my family, my family, then took, then tell me that uh, make I go hospital. I spend many money for that blood. It can never stop. Oh. They express me that that I was really die. But you see what God could be, not do. On Jesus. Jesus. Yes, have, you, have you accepted Jesus as your savior? God is my savior. What the doctor, with anybody with that I hope they never be do before. But I thank God, my God, that the God retreat for me. Hey. Wow. Doctor, this is what? Hemorrhoids. Hemorrhoids. Bleeding chronic. Classic. Chronic. Wow. The power of God. 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 You see? The power of God. You see, the testimony is interesting for 15 years. Yes. Always. Ah, for a dumb man who didn't know go here, the man didn't know it all. Man menstruating. That's man menstruating. Oh, she go shoe. Oh, for she go shoe. For the man don't go. Give everybody, give Jesus a mighty, mighty, mighty clap of praise. Eh, pate for Jesus. Listen, eh, Where is the man who gave his watch? Talenitofi agore sheore. There is a, the guy who came here. Eh, akuni to wabileka. His leg was leg. swollen. Tomorrow night, I'm going to take a special offering for your miracle. Apart from the offering that they will take. In front here. And I believe that that seed will be a seed for your miracle in Nigeria in the name of Jesus. So tomorrow when you are coming, come with a special offering for healing Jesus crusade, God will bless you and God will heal you. Amen. For one year, for one year, four and a half months, this man had a stroke. He could not lift his right hand. He could not lift his right leg. And he could not talk properly. You remember when the evangelist was preaching, he talked about the stroke, that the, 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 the part of the brain dies. Exactly that. But when you were praying, the power of God came on him. He said that? when you said you should do what you could not do. He said suddenly, he lifted his hand and the hand went up. Lifted the leg, the leg, the leg. And he could also not talk properly. He said it was lay, it was, he could not talk properly. Yes, yes. Kilo Shele. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Shele. Moti moti lo adukun ati osun merin ati bi jo meje ati jo meje ba adukun ati osun merin ati jo meje ngbe le joke ti ko lu mi ngbe ni mo tu gbadura si ka me so ogun sugbon mo si ti mo ti ya le ologun ba o yin ba se o to daju mo ti ya le ologun so ni gba wa nu adura kan ko ke baba a gbadura fun ani ngbe mo na ka me a ka mi keju na tele tele oju na o se me oju ja mo le that is a the voice is clearing where well, that is clear he, could lift his hand. he could not lift the hand before but now he can lift it up and the voice that is not clear is clearing ask him you could not lift his hand you could eh, not lift the hand. But my 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 okay. He could not lift it like that before, but now he can lift it properly. You cannot bend it before. Oh yeah, she do it, do it. Oh, look at him, match, match, doctor. Stroke, stroke is healed. This man could not lift his hand. Right. What, what does it mean? It means the brain, it means God has touched the brain. That's what you said when you were preaching. The part of the brain which is dead has been brought alive again by the power of God. Hey. No surgery, no, no medicine, nothing. Are you happy? 
When you learn logo, say no you do. Olua se o no me do. Inu you do. How do you say are you happy? Say no re do. No me do. Say no re do. Say no re do. Eh. Say no re do. No me do. Say no re do. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God has begun a powerful miracle in this young girl. She fell from the Okada, the, the motorcycle, Okada, three months Okada. ago. And after she fell, she became blind in both, ear, in both eyes. She couldn't see. But tonight, as soon as you finish praying, she suddenly realized that her vision has become clear. Something she could not see at all. She's now able to see clearly. Oh, dear God, I love this. You know, let me just make a sign. Go, lady, run it by Shubu. Ye, Shubu, ni asana basan badura. Oh, ti lady, no. What happened to you in the accident? Kilo chere simba te Shubu loni okada. I got blinded, and in fact, so things that are much happened to me because. So what you couldn't see? Yes, I couldn't. Eh, lady, no bye. Yes, I couldn't see then. Shubu, see see you come. I can see now. You can see now. Yes. When, when were you here? When did you start to see? When, it, it, when I was there, when they were praying. Today. 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 Lonely. Yes. And we were praying. Yes. You started to see. Yes. Can, can you see me? Very well. What do I look like? You, you are a chocolate in color. I'm what? Chocolate. 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 I am chocolate. Yesterday I was a white man. Today I'm chocolate. Today I'm chocolate. Can you see me? Chocolate. Very well. But you couldn't see that before. Yes. So now you can see. Yes. Touch my nose. This is your nose. Oh. Oh, power come oh. This lady fell from Okada, Okada. Okada and became blind. She must have had a head injury. What head mean? injury or a retinal, retinal detachment. Retinal, from oju. retinal detachment. Oju. What is retinal detachment? The, kilo a part a kilo. in the eye, the back of the eye, which is like the screen where ni oju, the things you see for all the screen in the eye. Yes, it's like a film. It can, it, can can it, can, can, it can come off when you are hit or you fall down. And when it comes off, permanently blind. So you can have a total retinal detachment of Asia. But hers was total. How do you say retinal detachment? Father, Amazing miracles tonight. Amazing. Why don't you stand, everybody? Stand to your feet stand and give your feet. Jesus a mighty mighty love and shout wow. offering. The blind are seen. The lame are walking. Strokes are being healed. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Father, Jesus. Hey, so many miracles. Come on. Quickly. Since 2001, Last this year, young man had something like scale, a skin disease. That was like a scale all over his body. His hand, everything, had some white patches coming out. Said so it will itch. Then he'll be scratching himself. Every week he has to come. He was in boarding school. Come home for medicine. Come home for medicine. Yesterday, after the prayer, he after the prayer realized that the itch has stopped. And then the skin. And then today, he realized that everything had cleared. Look at him. I can't even see anything. He was removing his shirt to show me. Let him tell us. Stomach everywhere. Skin. But yes. I worry. I was having an eczema. That is a skin disease. Since I have gone so many hospitals, FMC, though. I have to go and collect apps from the other list, but yes, it didn't work. But yesterday, while while you said out anywhere that is was, I would place an hand on it. So I now place my hand on it. How so did you know pray. where to put your hand since it was all over? I, I put my hand only here. Yeah. I put my hand only on my hand. So after the prayer, I now searched on my body. Everything was dry. I couldn't find any sores on my body again. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Are you listening?
listening to miracles that are happening. Today we are in a hospital watching miracles. I want to live with a theological cases. I see. What happened? He had a, a skin condition. Only wow. and and it's it's it, it has disappeared. Hey. Can you explain why a skin disease yeah, yeah, disappeared? Only the power of God, God can do this. And, and you've been to many doctors. I have gone to so many doctors. Mention FMC, for, for, uh, FMC do General Hospital and Okuru Meado and Sprint Faith and do so many hospitals. <laughs> Herbalist? Yes, I don't know. It has no shot. Yes. But yesterday, Tumalana, you put your hand there. Yes, and, it and it just got dry. Yes. Oh. Everything has disappeared. Why oh, don't you give no Jesus trace. a mighty clap offering? No yeah, but they want oh, for Jesus. A powerful miracle. Hallelujah. Hey. Tonight is a wonderful miracle. Our mother came from Aramako. Aramako said. She's been suffering from persistent headaches. Only two loops every and two healed. hours. The power of God touched her. Father, thank, thank you, for you for Only two Thank you, Jesus. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Let hey, them come. Mama, let them come. This is a nurse herself, and for some months she's not, not slept. Let the voice you make for us soon. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm a chief nursing officer. Chief nursing officer. Yes. Only she go nurse you go to UCH. I have every sensation of the brain since mm. six months ago. For the past three weeks, I've never slept. They say it's raised BP, and my blood pressure since four weeks ago was 12080, and yet I'm still having the peppering sensation of the brain. But today I came to my sister. I came from a very far place. I don't live at Igero. So my sister forced me to come here today. Then immediately I arrived at this town, I just came here by 4.30 p.m. So when you asked us for the miracle time, I stood up and I started praying. So help me thank the Lord and help me praise the Lord. And I've been here, all the time has gone. Go lay soon. The pain has gone. The pain has gone. And it was there for how long? For the past six months. The pain has gone. The pain has gone. Like and you do what 12. did they diagnose? You are a nurse. What yes, did they I mean, do? they say it's raised BP, hypertension. One be a son, a jeruni, causing that sensation. Yes. Yes. Pain. Yes. 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 So you have this type of awesome. feeling. Psychosomatic. Exactly. That oh, so you so you Lord Lord Jesus Jesus Quickly. Quickly. Let let them come. Tomorrow night, everybody must come with a soul. Somebody come with somebody else. Yes. When you no, are coming, no, don't come alone. What is happening there? Strength in the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Father, thank you. Thank you, Lord. In the thank name you, of Jesus. Christ. Thank you for the healing. The thank you for the healing. Street. Be healed. Tonight we apply the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, in the name of the Jesus. Blood of Jesus. From the blood of Jesus. The blood, the, the blood of Jesus. What's the blood of Jesus. What's the blood of Jesus? Kin is your own. Get many things to give. Kin is your own. And in his eyes, the glimpse that power that sees the heart. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. 
receive your healing. Receive your healing. In Jesus' name. We apply the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Yes, the blood of Jesus. 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 Be healed in Jesus' name. Be made whole in Jesus' name. Receive your touch tonight. Receive your touch. Receive strength tonight. Receive strength tonight. Jesus. Receive strength tonight. Thank you, Lord. Receive strength tonight. Yes. Receive strength tonight. Yes. Receive strength tonight. Yes, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Receive strength tonight. Receive strength tonight. Yes. Yes. Receive strength tonight. Receive strength tonight. Yes. Yes. Receive strength tonight. As we call Receive strength tonight. In Jesus' name, be healed. Amen. In Jesus' name, be healed. Amen. In Jesus' name, be healed. Jesus' name. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your touch. A touch. Your touch. Your touch. Your touch. Your touch. Your touch. Receive a touch. A healing 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 touch. Receive your touch. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Receive your touch. Jesus, thank you. Oh, Jesus. 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 Receive your touch. Receive your touch. Receive your touch in Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Receive your healing. To see this Jesus name from Danny. Jesus yes. the carpenter. Some I want it in for touch. I'm a good sorrow. Tia, 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 sorrow. He gets many meals to give him bread. Be healed, be healed, be healed, be healed. Be healed, be healed, be healed. Be healed in Jesus' name. Oh, Father, we thank you for healing. For miracles, Lord. Thank you. For your power, Lord. For your power, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And this speaks as far. Be healed. Be healed. He comes. Be healed. 